Armed robbery that took place overnight in the short north is now raising awareness from Columbus police regarding pedestrian safety. NBC 4's Jonathan Jackson is live tonight in the short north and you talked with authorities on the safety tips and guidance that they're asking people to follow now, right Jonathan? That's right, Colleen. Just this month, Columbus police have already responded to several shootings and felonious assaults here in the short north, and they're asking pedestrians to keep safety in mind. Now, this comes after a group of people who were walking along the short north late last night were robbed at gunpoint around 1 a.m. Police tell us they are still investigating the matter. However, they're asking everyone to stay along the main sidewalk streets here. Furthermore, they say don't be on your phone the whole time. Be aware of your surroundings and know where you're going before leaving. And if you are alone, officers say to make sure someone knows where you are. If you have to be by yourself, instead of looking down at your phone, hold your phone up to your ear or put it on speakerphone and call a friend, call somebody so you, they know where you're at at all times. And this weekend, Columbus police also told us they'll be increasing their presence not only in the short north, but also citywide as well. Local for you in the short north, I'm Jonathan Jackson, NBC4. Jonathan, thank you. Bowling Green State University is now banning or suspending 20 students over the death of a fraternity pledge who died after an annual hazing ritual. 20-year-old pledge Stone Foltz was found.